Hello and welcome. Let's see how to create vectors using a special function called wrap. Wrap stands for replicate or repeat. So with the function wrap, we can create vectors with replicated values. We must specify two arguments for this function, the value itself and the number of times to replicate it. For example, here we create a new vector x by replicating the value 5 three times. Let's do that. And let's print the vector x. So the vector x has three components, all with the same value, 5. Of course, we can do the same for strings and logical values. For example, let's create a vector y that replica replicates sorry, the value Chris the string Chris, six times. Here it is. And now let's create a new vector z that replicates the value true four times. Here it is. We have true four true values. Very important, we can combine the functions wrap and c concatenate to replicate an entire vector not just one value. For example, here I create a vector w by replicating, replicating the vector 1, 2, 3, 5 times. Please note that the values 1, 2, 3 are put in the c function and everything is put under the wrap function. Let's create the vector w. Please look down here in the console. You notice that you have the sequence 1, 2, 3 repeated 5 times. We can also replicate the vector element y, so element by element. One, the, the, the element 1, 5 times, the element 2, 5 times, and finally the element 3, 5 times. For this, we have to use the each argument. So here I'm going to create a new vector t by replicating the vector 1, 2, 3, 5 times, but element-wise, element by element. Let's see what we get. Okay, as you can notice here, 1 is repeated here 5 times, then 2 is repeated 5 times, then 3 is repeated five times. Very simple. That's all about the replicate function. Thank you.